It's Road Trip Sunday. We're at High Cliff State Park in eastern Wisconsin, and today we're going to find out how the window screen ground plane works with a non resonant antenna. So please stick around for more. On our last activation, we had really good luck uh, using the window screen as our ground plane or counterpoise. That, that time we were using uh, either the Wolf River coil or a quarter wave vertical uh, extendable whip on the, on the uh, 20 and 15 meter bands. Uh, but what happens if we use a non-resonant antenna? Well, this time for this activation, I am going to pull out the chameleon. Uh, Whip. We're going to use the Chameleon Impasse 2, set up the 19-foot um, vertical uh, whip, and uh, see what happens. CQ CQ parks on the air. CQ parks on the air. KB9 VBR. Kilo Bravo Niner Victor Bravo Romeo calling CQ for parks on the air. Kilo Charlie 1 Romeo Victor Yankee. Kilo Charlie 1 Romeo Victor Yankee. 55 uh, five, Wisconsin park number Kilo 1456. Back to you. Michael. Good Alright, well thanks for the 58 Connecticut. You have a great day in 7 3. This is KB9 VBR, Parks on the Air, QRZ. Kilo India 5, Lima Echo Yankee, uh, 53 Wisconsin, park number Kilo 1456. Back to you. All right, thanks for the Texas. You have a great day and 7 3. November 4, Charlie Papa Lima, 53 Wisconsin, park number Kilo 1456. Back to you. Okay, got November 4, Charlie Papa. What's the last letter again? All right, November 4, Charlie Papa Radio. Thanks for the correction. Uh, bad copy. A lot of I got a lot of I got a noise. A lot of noise here. So, uh, uh, five three Wisconsin Park number Kilo one four five six. Back to you. All right. Thanks for the five five Florida. You have a great day and seven three. Thank you so much. Keep up the good work with the videos. Hey, it's my pleasure. Glad you enjoy them. Hey, if you like this video and you want to see more like it, hit that like and subscribe button. That's my indicator to make more of these style of videos. Thank you for your support. Kilo Fox 6, Bravo something. Kilo Fox 6, Bravo Mexico, thank you. A 4 4 Wisconsin with a lot of fade. Uh, kilo 1456, back to you. Roger the Kilo 0041 in California. Thanks a lot for the park today. Yeah, to your call, sign, please. call sign again is Kilo Bravo Niner Victor Bravo Romeo QSL.
Roger, Roger. Yeah, it's the uh, band is tough. Uh, location is Kilo one four five six. I repeat, one four five six High Cliff State Park, Wisconsin. QSL. Uh, QSL Wisconsin. QSL Wisconsin. All right. Well, I don't feel so bad. It's been yeah. It's uh. It's tough. It's tough out there today. So uh, best of luck to you. Hopefully you, you, you make it. Roger, Roger. 7-3. Uh, Have a good one. Uh, KB9VBR. Parks on the air. QRZ. High Cliff State Park is located on the shores of Lake Winnebago, just outside of Appleton, Wisconsin. And what you see behind me is a piece of rock that is actually connected a, a hundreds of miles to Niagara Falls in uh, New York State. Uh, we're standing on what's called the Niagara Escarpment. It is a ridge that extends from southeastern Wisconsin all the way up around Lake Michigan through uh, southern Ontario over to Niagara Falls. Uh, the escarpment was created some 400 million years ago. This whole area was underwater, a giant sea, and um, this was sort of the uh, the, 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 the seabed and through uh, millions of years uh, turned into a tough um, rock called dolomite. Uh, geological forces pushed it up and created this ridge or escarpment and uh, sort of a shallow bowl where uh, Lakes Michigan and Huron are formed. Okay, November, uh, thank you. November 4, Lima Delta Bravo. Got you, 3 3, way down in the weeds. Park number Kilo 1456. Back to you. Roger, the uh, 8156 in South Dakota. Yeah, it's uh, uh, deep, a lot of deep fades, but um, you, were, you came up loud that last time. You too have a great activation too. Um, take care. KB9 VBR parks on the air. QRZ. Kilo November 4 Alpha Lima parks the park. Kilo November 4 Alpha Lima, uh, 51 Wisconsin park number Kilo 1456. Back to you. Roger, Roger on the Kilo 1456. I've got you 5 by 3, 5 3 into two parts. The first one is Kilo 6737, and the second one is 6717. QSL? QSL the 6737 and Kilo 6717. Whiskey 9, Bravo Delta X-Ray. Whiskey 9, Bravo Delta X-Ray, 53 Wisconsin, park number Kilo 1456. Back to you. QSL, you're about a 55 five, Illinois. 55 five, five, Illinois. Thanks for the 55 five, Illinois. Uh, you have a great day, 73. This is KB9 VBR, Parks on the air, air, last call. Our Sunday road trip wouldn't be complete if we didn't stop for lunch. And where else are we going to go in Appleton, Wisconsin? But the Cozy Corner, home of the uh, world famous chicken and waffles. Best soul food you're ever going to find in the state of Wisconsin.
Today is certainly a challenging radio day, and that's really no fault of the MPAS-2 antenna. Uh, the MPAS-2 is a uh, multi-band vertical antenna with a 5 to 1 transformer. Probably not the most efficient antenna out there, but it's it does offer decent performance, and I've always had pretty good luck using it. Uh, what I did today is instead of using the counterpoise that comes with the MPAS, we added the uh, the ground screen, the window screen that I used in a previous video, and um, that gave us a very good match, which was very promising, and it worked quite well, I, th I think. Uh, good signal reports, uh, band conditions were um, not the best, a uh, solar storm going on right now, <laughs> so it was... Uh, tough. It was tough to pick out signals, but the signals that we were able to um, to get, you know, good signal, you know, decent decent signal reports. If I was probably using one of my other verticals, like the uh, the quarter wave, probably would have been a little bit stronger, one to two S units stronger. But um, still, I uh, was able to get 37 contacts at this active at this park. Um, let's see, 30 of them were on the uh, 20 meter band. Uh, moved down to 40 meters, got seven on 40 meters, so it was, um, we operated for about 45 minutes here, not an exceedingly long amount of time, but um, enough to, you know, get some contacts, uh, visit the park, uh, see if this, see if my theory, if um, using the window screen will work well with the MPAS 2, and um, I think it's good, it's a viable solution. Uh, like I said, good matches, we're able to tune things up really nice. I, could, I probably could have run a couple of the bands without the tuner at all. Uh, SWR was looking good on the meter, but um, so um, keep that in mind. If you've got a non-resonant antenna, uh, you can use the same window screen concept as uh, we did with the uh, the resonant style antennas. So that's an option there. Uh, makes for fast uh, setup and teardown. So, well, that's it for this um, uh, this park here, High Cliff State Park. Thanks for joining me. I'm Michael KB9 VBR. Have a great day in seven three. CQ, CQ, Parks on the Air, CQ, Parks on the Air, KB9, VBR, Kilo, Bravo, Niner, Victor, Bravo, Romeo, calling CQ for Parks on the Air. KB9, VBR, this is KC9, BME. KC9, BME, KB9, VBR, Solid 5-9 into High Cliff State Park, Kilo, 1456, back to you. This is KC9, BME, and uh, you are coming in uh, loud and clear, <laughs> I forget, 5-9, uh, about 12 feet away at High Cliff State Park in Whiskey, India. Roger that. Thanks for the contact. 73. 73. KC9 BME. KB9 VBR. Parks on the air. Curious.